It began before dawn, early Sunday morning. Early Sunday afternoon, Camille brushes past the mouth of the Mississippi. At first, she only blows a few shingles off the roofs. Then she begins ravaging the whole Louisiana Delta. Upriver, the levees are beginning to crumble under pressure of wind and water. Finally, at Burus, the levee breaks. Time to get out. And now the few who lingered are running for their lives, north to New Orleans and safety. By late afternoon, advance winds are touching the Mississippi coast. By 8 o'clock, power lines are falling, starting fires, and winds are whipping them out of control. Even in New Orleans, on the outer edge of the street, begins flooding part of the city. It's 10 o'clock in Biloxi now, and the eye of the storm, they say, is still over two hours away. The wind is so strong, one can hardly stand up in it. The rain is torrential. Streets are flooded. We are cut off from the outside world in our motel here. There is no power. Everything is black. Rescue red to CD control. 